Okay guys, first cast of the new rods ever. I reckon first fish will, will probably be a Port Jackson. What do you reckon Dave? <laughs> yeah, definitely. <laughs> okay. This is my Port Jackson spot. This <laughs> yeah. is where I put us in. And you just cast randomly to the side, yeah? Yeah, mate. <laughs> I only fish my Port Jackson mark when you're getting tired. Very good. Let's see what happens. That's a red. It's a genuine silver. Yes. I think it's a little one. Bloody age. What? What happened? <laughs> I spotted. I think it's just a pinky. It's alright. First snapper on the new rods and reels. Well, we don't know that yet. Oh, we know that. It's not a little one. Oh, it hasn't done any runs. That is definitely a snapper. I'm not getting the net for you either. Okay. <laughs> Can you get my phone that's ringing? No. <laughs> Oh no, it's a 20 pounder, isn't it? You've done it again. Yeah, it hasn't even done a run. This is on the gut bait. There it is. Oh, oh. it's a good fish. <laughs> Alright. Alright, you're right, it's probably better four. <laughs> That's more than a four. I'll get the net. I'll have to walk to it. Oh, it's got a bump head. Net cam. Pretty bumpy. Oh, nah, 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 nah. Uh, it's a bumpy, Dave. You have to walk onto another boat. Oh, he's barely hooked. He's barely hooked. Okay, okay. <coughs> yes! Boom. Um, Here you go, you grab the net. Thanks. He's actually pretty well hooked. I oh, just got scared. These are on our new rods. Could wow. not. <laughs> That's a good start. Yeah. And um, I just saw the rod in the holder just do a little couple of bounces. Did you cap film that as well? Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. um, it barely fought. <laughs> and it's got a beautiful bump. Have a look at this. Wow, that's a long dish. Um, yeah, he's, he's hooked inside the mouse, so I don't think he was going anywhere. But I did give him a tug, just to make sure. Yeah, he is pretty nice. So we've uh, christened the, the new rods. What are reels. they? So these are the new energy concept. Yeah, we just replaced them with our old. Yeah. And we decided to upgrade the reels, same reels, but just new ones. Oh, I'll give us a look at the fish. Okay. I'm back, guys. I'm You're back. back. Oh. Yeah. You're back? No. Did you just get a spine in your hand? Yep. Oh, so right your oh my, my god. Show me your finger. <laughs> no. no, show me. Oh. Oh. I got it. <laughs> Went through that bit. That I'm wasn't. Gonna, I'm not going to say that wasn't funny. I didn't want to show you that because it was almost embarrassing. Wow. Cracker. <laughs> Good fish. Yeah. Woo! I'm back, guys. So that's for the season. Look at that beautiful bump. Yeah. You're a pretty fish. Wow. Look at some nice photos, boy. Oh, oh, go Dave. Oh, am I going Yeah, go, it's on. Yes, you've hooked him. Yes, good fish, Dave. Oh, and that other one's on. Which one? Rod one. I 
think it's a pee day. Oh, just dropped. Good. Yeah. I'm just gonna leave that in the holder there. I'm gonna help you. How you going, Dave? Feel like a good fish? Yeah, no, it's not a bad one. Whoa. Nah, I think it's on that. Do I need to put this no, no, loose in the drag? I'll sort it. But do I need to loosen the drag so it doesn't? I think it should be fine. So you don't want it to be tight. Good, Dave. Fighting better than my one, I got. Looks like you got good load on too. I'm only running six out sickers. Oh, -hoo -hoo! good stuff. This is a grand final barbecue fish or what? Could be. How do you feel, Dave? Christening the new rod? I hope this one doesn't fall off. Jam so Rod Rod Fours seems to be catching the fish today. You doing good, Dave? As soon as I see colour, I'm going for a swoop. It's not big. Not oh, got him! It can. Yeah. There's that other line. Yeah, you can feel something. Oh, yeah, it's around. It's it's around the fish. Um, hang on. I'll freeze ball this and sort that out. Well, so I got it out, and then he's rehooked himself. been sitting on it. <laughs> it's been sitting in the holder. We've been calling it cod for the last five minutes. And Dave just picks it up. <laughs> I'm glad I chose rod too. Yeah. No one wants to wind in a cod, so we just leave it as long as possible. And uh, Dave's been rewarded with uh, actually wanting to wind the cod in. Oh! Ooh, no, that's not oh, yeah. Right, I'm gonna cast this one back out. That's it. That looks like a decent fish. Yeah, that's a good fish. That's um grand final fish, I reckon. Yeah. One each for the family, one for grand final. That's a good fish. Yeah. What the hell? He's been sitting, just munching, munching and grazing on that for so long. Tabo! There he is. Right. Oh, hang on, he gone. Ah, oh, got him! Whoa, the hook pulled! <laughs> Did it? Are you yep. kidding? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's gonna go too, baby. So, what just happened, Dave? Uh, as it went in the net, the hook pulled out. Yeah, but with this fish in general, what actually happened? Oh, we happened? were just getting little twizzles on the rod, and we left it for a while just in case it was a snapper. And then we're like, nah, we will admit the fact that it was a cod. Yeah. I went to wind it in, and she loaded up, and <laughs> straight off. And just as we netted it, the hook pulled. Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. So, we're going to keep it. When we keep fish, we want to make sure we look after them. So, straight away, pull it out of the net. Yep. Make sure there's no hooks flying around. But in this case, there's none. Pull it out of the nets. Then we're going to inky spike him. Yep. And spike how do we do that? So, spiking them, obviously, is humane because it puts the fish out straight away. Yep. Also, it makes it taste better because they don't get rigor mortis. The flesh is nice and relaxed. A little depression just behind his eye. And that's it there. Yep. That's where the tip goes in. You'll hit skull, give it a hit, and that's it. 
So normally they go pale or their fins go up like that and vibrate. Yep. That's when you hit the brain. And that's a very humane way of doing it. Yep. Good for eating. Humane way to put the fish out of its misery. Yep. And then from there, straight onto ice. Very nice. Anyway, should probably move all the rods over to this side of the boat. We're like swinging against the current now. Like 